Okay, so today I'm working on this lamp. I'm building this lamp for my mother-in-law. It is a piece of driftwood that I pulled out of Lake Powell. Uh, and the history is that my mother and father-in-law and my wife and family, their family, have been going down to Lake Powell since it started filling in 1963 before there were any roads or marinas and stuff like that and they've been going down there and houseboating and camping and so I want to make this for her it's her 80th birthday this year 2021 is her January of 2021 is her 80th birthday don't know if I'll have it ready for then but that's what that looks like now. It came off of this. It was attached right here. I cut it and that's what I brought back was this piece of wood. And I think I have one a piece that I can get one more project out of it. I might make a smaller lamp, uh, put the socket right here in the V and make a, a smaller lamp out of it maybe do something uh, you know creative but that's what it came from I don't know what kind of wood it is but I'm going to I'm in the process today so I, I, I cut it I sandblasted it and then I've drilled the hole and I've got the the hole all the way through it you can see I've got a hole all the way through it so I was gonna put it on this metal base and I bought this metal base and I welded these legs on these feet so it'd sit flat that was option two option one was to put it on this rock and I've gone back to option one. I'm going to try to put it on that rock. So today I'm going to stain it. And uh, then I'm going to work on getting it ready to put on the rock. So this stain that I'm using is from their hardwood floors. Uh, I've had this for years. I did a little job for them years ago. And this, uh, this little bit of stain is from... Uh, their home I think it was their floors and it says I don't know if you can read it but it says 1992 on it so I'm gonna stain it with that and then I'm gonna clear it and then I'm gonna try to build a lampshade out of these pieces that we found in the desert in Arizona pieces of metal that rock came from Arizona so let me do some work on it and I'll bring you in and show you the progress Okay, so I put a coat of stain on it. I'm gonna let it dry. It's not gonna be too dark, it's gonna lighten up some. But yeah, that's part of the project. It's got some real character. I think they call these burls. I'm not sure. I don't know if that was a root off of a tree of some kind or or what, but it sure was an interesting piece. I knew I could do something with it. Yeah, there's the old Ford. Painting the house, furniture's out here. Been working on fixing furniture and yeah. Projects, projects. okay so here it is stained and I've got a coat of uh, clear on it and I've got the rock or the base all set up I've got it covered so I don't spray clear on the rock but I'm starting to do the finish on it it's hard to tell how shiny it is but I'm gonna put several coats of clear on it 
and then uh, build a lampshade for it. I think it's going to turn out really cool. I love it. Okay, working on a couple projects today. There's the lamp glued together, just letting it set up. I used body filler as the glue to glue that in. Then this is going to be the shade. These, I've got a whole bunch of these that I found. And I'm working on that, but I'm also working on this. This is a piece of a railroad track that I dug up while doing the excavation with my cousin. And I'm going to try to make that into an anvil. So I'm going to be grinding on that and trying to clean it up, but I thought I'd take a snapshot of it before I get too far into it. So I've decided to make another one. Another lamp. I cut this off a... Oh, where was it? Here somewhere. Had a broken, had to be this way. Had to be this way. But I cut that off. And then I still have this piece. Kind of skinny, but maybe I can sneak one out of it. But, yeah, here's another one gonna put it on a metal base the uh, the uh, lights gonna come up the middle and uh, gonna put it on that metal base and yeah I think this one's gonna be for Susan my wife grandmother best friend I'm sure there's some other acronyms but she'd get mad if I said them but uh, yeah there's another one let's go in and I'll show you the one that's finished so I don't know if I got any video of it being finished but there it is that one I put on a rock base Susan and I picked that rock up in Arizona the uh, lamp itself is driftwood the guts or the lamp part of it was given to me by my neighbor I made a I read purposed it and then we went and bought this shade the shade I was building I didn't like the way it was turning out and then we found this shade that just is beautiful so there you go I'll show you a little more as I get going this has the stain on it from uh, my mother and father-in-law's wood floors and I stained it and then it's got probably five or six coats of clear on it and it's pretty cool it's a cool lamp and there it is with the light on I hope she likes it it's for her 80th birthday my mother-in-law's 80th birthday so there it is I'll show you the other one when I get it done